Russ, another pleasing performance there. You must be happy with what you saw there. Um, I'm delighted. Obviously, I'm going to get carried away. It's um, you know, it's, it's a pre-season game. We know that. So um, you know, nothing rests on it. No points are gained or lost. But very pleasing performance. You have to remember the temperature out there today. Um, I thought this whole game was uh, very pleasing. We looked uh, solid, compact, organised without the ball, and we were creative with the ball. Um, Caused Stuttersfield uh, lots of problems. It's got a really good goal as well. Great bit of play down the right hand side, and probably could have had a couple more. But uh, again, we're not going to get carried away. But uh, fitness levels look good. You know, that's a really good workout for a lot of the lads um, in, in that heat. You know, and come August 9th, 9th it might be that hot again. But um, some good individual performances um, and collectively as, as a group, I thought we were outstanding. It was a tough first half for the lads, but they really came to light, didn't they? In the to start the second half, that was a bright start in the second half. Yeah, I just thought the overall game, it was pleasing because they've, they've thrown out a 3-5-2 system, you know, and they're trying to overload the midfield uh, 3v2, but what we did, we, we narrowed off as a, as a midfield four, dropped a striker in, okay, had to sit a little bit deep at times, but let's be honest, you're playing against people like Naki Wells, uh, who for me is a top, top class striker, they've uh, pinched him personally for the price they've got him. If they put him back on the market tomorrow, he'll be looking at three, four million for that lad. He's, he's top quality and still only 23. So delighted with his uh, two centre-halves, delighted with his back four. Creative in midfield and hard-working. And 